Antimicrobial resistance, or AR, is a threat to the health of communities. Every year in the US, over 2.8 million people are infected with a resistant organism, and every year over 35,000 people die from an AR infection. AR develops when organisms like bacteria and fungi develop the ability to defeat the drugs that are designed to kill them. This limits the treatment options, and these infections can often be very difficult, if not impossible, to treat. Well, our CDC AR laboratory network was established in 2016. Its purpose is to close the gaps between the local laboratory capabilities of identifying the pathogens with driving the response and the appropriate containment and control efforts that are needed to follow up with those information. Efforts to detect and prevent the spread of resistant infections start at a clinical lab. Clinical labs do testing for patient care, and when clinical labs identify a resistant isolate, they send it to AR Lab Network Labs, where public health labs do additional testing and additional characterization to further improve and further inform the response to prevent the spread of these organisms. At the Wisconsin State Laboratory of Hygiene, we perform testing for the state of Wisconsin to identify and respond to AR threats. And as the Midwest Regional Lab for the AR Lab Network, we also support five additional states in our region for enhanced capacity for more testing, as well as enhanced characterization to better understand these organisms. The AR Lab Network allows every state to connect with CDC subject matter experts and also allows each regional lab to communicate closely with the states within their region to best support them in their identification and response to AR organisms. The high-level characterization that we perform as a regional lab includes whole genome sequencing to get an entire blueprint of the organism's DNA, and this provides a very good understanding of the organism as well as the ability to tell if organisms are related to identify outbreaks and respond to outbreaks better. The AR Lab Network has transformed the laboratory capacity in the U.S. by boosting staffing and infrastructure, by enhancing technology to identify AR threats, to respond to outbreaks of them, and to prevent them from spreading in the future. The data that we produce helps guide response to outbreaks of AR threats to prevent the spread of these very resistant organisms.